Jazz is nervous this morning. Starting to think the beach workout would have been a good choice. On a scale of 1 to 10 nervousness, how nervous are you? Uh, not half as nervous as I will be when I get up there. Why do I agree to do these things? You've got the GoPro, good luck. Oh. Uh, Jim, it's all Jim's fault. Do you have to go? 90% of the beaches in Tenerife are, are black. Because this island is a volcanic island. Fact. The ones that are not, they're man-made. Fact. Shocked me a little bit. Black beach. I know what you're thinking. This looks like the start of the CrossFit Games. Fact. Yeah, Jazz this morning is doing something that, to be honest, I didn't have the balls to do. I'm going to be brutal, brutally honest. But instead, I'm doing the beach workout. Jazz is jumping off a cliff. I didn't bring my goggles. I hate swimming without goggles on the beach. So I'm just waiting outside. Jim, <clears throat> we're being picked up at 10 o'clock. A slight change of plan because it's so cloudy today, as you can see. We are now going on the propeller-driven one. So it's still like, nervous, though. See, and this guy, yeah. Damien, has so. reassured us it is very safe. <laughs> still very nervous, though. This morning's workout seems to have drawn a crowd. Yep, those are just people standing on the edge watching guys work out. That sounded in my beard the whole time I talked to you guys just then. <laughs> we get to see somebody actually do this and take off before we, we do it, so... That, right there, is what we're going to be doing. What are your thoughts, Jim? Uh, we, we've still got time to get out of this, haven't we? <laughs> 20 minutes, 25 down, it's time to do it. We've committed now, yeah, yeah, we're, we're fully committed. We're <laughs> Genuinely petrified. Did you just see that take off? I was going to say that one looked better, but I'm not sure it did. <laughs> I don't think it did. When <laughs> <laughs> we got to that there, I was thinking, oh, that's nice and smooth. 21, 18, 15, 12. Sandbag thrusters, burpees over the sandbag. After each set, you got to run about 100 meters. 200 meters. <laughs> Jazz, is that you? Jazz? Jazz? Twelve, nine, six. Sandbag cleans and swim. Part two.
I have so much sand in my hair, it's incredible. There's sand everywhere. Epic morning at the beach. Running in the sand is super hard. Switching up the environment is always super fun. One of my top pieces of equipment for CrossFit, sandbag. Do over the shoulders for posterior chain. Run with it on your back, just makes running 10,000 times worse. Lunges, cleans, thrusters, deadlifts, drags. And all you need is a bag and some cheap sand. Burpees over the sandbag. Honestly, if someone came up to me and said, I want to get fit, what are probably the two big things that I should get? One is a barbell with a pair of bumpers, and two, it's a sandbag. All right, now we just wait for Jazz to come back from a crazy morning. How was the gym? Alive. I was ace. Absolutely ace, yeah. It was amazing. On the way back down, he was like, rrr, rrr, and I was like, oh. <laughs> Are you really on holiday if you don't get a Fanta lemon? So you're going to the games next year? <laughs> Possibly, maybe. So where are you from? Orland Islands. Which is actually now classed as its own little place. Yeah, mm -hmm. That's right. Which, judging by the new rules, means that one person from that country will get to go to the game. How many people are in your country? Uh, about 20,000. That's like less than the population of our town. <laughs> Craig, we're moving. We nice. have Jamie Green, Camille LeBlanc, Bazinet, Jasmine Cabon. <laughs> Can you imagine? And she is wiped out on the first round. <laughs> she's come to the first bar, she's gone to clean it. This is way over her PB. It is double her PB. <laughs> she's still smiling. She's trying. <laughs> she is the best trier. Yes, I did, yeah, this is my, this is my haircut. Trying to be me, Jess. <laughs> Just like that, it's the end of the trip. Oh. Brush it. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. It's time to go back to the airport. Yeah, yeah. See you later, Henry. Yeah. It's just unfortunate that you lost your shoes. <laughs> Au revoir. Ciao. Down you go, Jess. Nice. Jazz, we can tell who the rebel of the group is. <laughs> right, Jim. <laughs> it's nice when you're in the airport and run into a couple of fans. Which one was it, Jazz, that was misbehaving? What, this little prick? <laughs> Jazz. You do it for me. You're more funny. I always you're more, do it. You're more funny. Put your head in it. <laughs> <laughs> 